Guys, I got a Gears 5 free in-game exclusive content with my Chips Ahoy. Thank God. So I haven't uploaded in like a month because I had to move out of my apartment because I was being harassed. And also I'm sick. But the music industry does not stop for me. And new shit has come out. So let's talk about it. I started listening to the new Big Thief. As I was driving around just now. And it just depressed me. So I stopped at a, a gas station. Shell to be exact. You can tell by the branding. And got some cookies. Um. Yeah. Big Thief is good. I like their stuff in the past. They're good at making you sad. But this album kind of depressed me in that. It didn't really do anything for me. Um, I feel like I'm seeing this with a lot of indie artists who were popular like two or three years ago, and they're making new stuff because they're like, well, it's been two or three years since I've made anything, let me make a new album. I'm speaking very generally, I'm not talking about big feet specifically with this, but... It feels like there's been a pattern of like, okay, well, I need to make something. Um, they do, and it just feels very uninspired and very, I don't know, unevolved. Like, they're trying to make the same thing that worked last time, but it doesn't have the same passion. It doesn't have the same audience. It doesn't have the same reciprocation because it's a different time. And it's just, I don't know, it's disappointing. Maybe I'm being too dramatic, but I just feel like indie and indie folk in general, like, this has been a bad year for it, because it just hasn't been hitting. And I was hoping Big Thief would change that, but didn't really. Felt kind of the same. Um, the first song, you just jump right into it, and it feels like, like the lull after the main chorus of a song. But that's just the whole song. And then that's the whole intro to the album. And I was like, what? I mean, okay, I guess. But I didn't really do anything for me. I don't know. I feel like Big Thief, one of the things they've been really like a powerhouse for is like their lyricism. Maybe I'm just not really listening to it as deeply as I should, but it just... It definitely was, like, the stronger thing on this album, but it just didn't really do much for me. I don't know, I'm, like, being really negative, but, like, it's not a bad album. Like, it's fine if you're gonna, like, listen to it while you're studying. Like, it's good. It's not bad. It's just, I get upset when stuff is, like, inoffensively generic, I guess? I don't know. I don't want to say it's generic, it just doesn't really do much. two songs that I liked. I can't remember their names. So. Two Hands and Wolf. We're good. <laughs> like classic. Classic Big Thief, but also kind of new, kind of different. Trying out something different, and it works well. But the whole album didn't really do that. So it just kind of made me sad. So now I'm sadly eating cookies. Cookies are good though. Also, I lost 10 pounds. I've been better about what I'm eating and how much of what I'm eating. I know this doesn't really reflect that, but. I 
Anyway, it's a new Big Thief. 6 out of 10, it's fine. That's about all I really got. I really want to make a video on new Danny Brown and new Peggy. But with more pizzazz than this. <laughs> so yeah, stay tuned. I guess, or don't. Do whatever you want. Bye.